Welcome back to Mobile Tech Road, and today I'm going to show you how the HTC Titan performs compared to a first generation Windows Phone 7 handset. Here we have the Samsung Amiya 7. So the Titan is powered by the MSM 8255 SoC clocked at 1.5 GHz, while the Samsung Amiya 7 is running a first generation Snapdragon QSD 8250 at 1 GHz with an Adreno 200 GPU, and the Titan has an Adreno 205 GPU. So as you can see, it's perfectly smooth on both handsets, but the Samsung Gamma 7 actually loads the tiles a little bit slower than the HTC Titan. So let's try to start some applications. Gonna start with Angry Birds and see which one is faster. So the HTC Titan was faster than the Omnia 7. Let's load a level. And you see that both devices perform exactly the same. So let's go back. And I'm going to show you how the Titan is actually faster at 3D rendering. So I'm going to start this CPU skinning sample. And as you can see, the HTC Titan is perfectly smooth doing GPU skinning. So this application is actually capped at 13 frames per second, but the Titan is probably going higher than that. And here you can see that the Samsung Omnia can go over 14 frames per second. So let's switch to CPU scanning. Omnia 7 is at 23. And uh, HTC Titan is running at 13 frames per second. Let's try another application. This is a fluid simulator, and as you will see here, HTC Titan is a lot smoother than the Samsung Amiya 7. Sorry, I can't really handle both devices at the same time, but as you can see, it's really fast on the Titan and it's a little bit slower and jerkier on the Samsung Gamma 7. It doesn't really show up in the video but there's really a big difference between the two and this is mainly because the CPU is clocked a lot higher on the Titan compared to the Samsung Gamma 7. So now let's try something else and I just want to point out that I'm have, I have a really really poor network connection right here so I'm actually using my 3D, 3G connection on the Titan and tethering it uh, to the Omnia 7 uh, with the Wi-Fi hotspot feature. So I'm going to start this application on both handsets and hope that it works. So first thing you'll notice is that the Titan is really smooth when panning left and right in the panorama, panorama control compared to Samsung Amiya 7 it's a little bit jerkier not that smooth but the big difference comes when you are actually browsing through a web browser control embedded in an application so let's hit the same story on both handsets and here you can see it's perfectly smooth Right, and now check it out on the Samsung Omnia. Really jerky, not that smooth, can't load everything. And here again on 
the HTC Titan. So this is basically where you'll see the big difference. It's in single light applications with panoramic controls and those who use uh, the web browser control to display web pages. So let's try the ESPN application on both handsets. Let's go to the lead. Here we go. And now I'm going to open the story on both handsets. Here it's perfectly smooth. And now the Omnia 7. Right. So I'm gonna zoom in, zoom in, scroll. And here big difference between the two. Other than that, there's no nothing really amazing in terms of performance. As you can see it's really smooth on both handsets. Web browsing is essentially the same. The HTC Titan is a little bit faster when you go back, when you navigate back to a previous web page. It loads it up faster than uh, the Samsung Gamma 7. But uh, really you, you ain't missing a lot. Uh, the main difference is really GPU performance. So if developers start to take advantage, advantage sorry, of the Adreno 200 and, and 5 GPU, uh, you'll see big differences in games. But uh, other than that, you know, it's really only in web browser controls and uh, panoramic, panoramic controls. Okay, so here now you can see the HTML5 performance of the HTC Titan compared to Samsung Omni 7. So here I'm running at 52 frames per second and Omni is at 30 frames per second. So let's go back and try the speed reading benchmark. So it only took two seconds on the HTC Titan. The Samsung Gamma 7 is still running. Still running, not finished yet. So it took 42 seconds on the Samsung Anya 7 and only 2 seconds on the HTC Titan. So this is a real, really big difference. So this was a quick look at the performance on the Titan compared to the first generation Windows Phone 7 handset. You can follow me right here, subscribe to my channel on YouTube at Mobile Tech World TV or go to mobiletechworld.com. Thanks for watching.